Good afternoon, Tigers, and welcome to Tiger Vision News for Friday, November 2nd. I'm Bryce, and this is Blake. Thank you for joining us today. Something pretty special will be happening in our library next week. Here's more with Ms. Ammons. Hi, I'm Melissa here with Mrs. Ammons. And when is the next FMS Book Fair? It starts Monday. And what will be for sale at the Book Fair? A lot of the same stuff you've seen before, hopefully some new books. Uh, lots of the books, uh, dystopian novels, there'll be some that fit the American Revolution assignment. Uh, and then there's always the fun stuff like the posters, the erasers, the pencils, and all that kind of stuff too. How long will the Book Fair last and what are the hours of each day going to be? Um, it will last all next week, Monday through Friday. I'll open it at 8 o'clock after the bell has rung, so you can't come in early. And then I will stay open until 3.30, 3.45, you know, kind of depending on what kind of shopping is still going on. Is there anything special we need to know about this year's book fair? We do have something a little different. The brand new Wimpy Kid book comes out the week after our book fair, but I get to sell it during our book fair. You'll be pre-buying it. And then when it comes in that following week, we will hand deliver it to you. I'm here with... Maddie. And what are you going to be buying at the book fair this year? A ton of books. Thank you. I'm here with... Jordan. Albert. And what are you going to be buying at the book fair this year? Toys. Toys. Thank you. What are you going to be buying at the book fair this year? Books and toys. Thank you. Make sure you visit the book fair. Part of this interruption, but we have some late breaking news for you. There will be a special meeting for all NJHS officers on Monday during lunch in Miss Dillon's room. All NJHS officers need to be there. That's Monday during lunch in Miss Dillon's room. Now, back to the news. We'll be back after this commercial break. As you may know, Mrs. Robertson's husband passed away last week. As a gesture of kindness and appreciation for her, we would like to make a love offering to help her get through this difficult time. During the book fair next week, there will be a special donation box for Mrs. Robertson located in the library. Bring your extra change and lead it in the donation box to show your appreciation for everything she has done for us. Thanks for helping Mrs. Robertson. Welcome back to Tiger Vision News. Anyone interested in competing in this year's spelling bee needs to get a special kind of form from Mr. Strickland's office. Go by and pick it up. Also, make sure you stop by the counselor's corner store on your way out. Ms. Schulte will have everything you need to get your weekend started off right. All treats are only a dollar or two, so be sure you load up. All money's going to Ms. Robertson. Give, give, give. Now let's check in with Reagan and see what's in our weather forecast. Hey guys, I'm Reagan here with your weather. Current conditions are 72 degrees, sunny, winds blowing to the southwest at 12 miles per hour. Here's a look at your regional forecast. It's clear all throughout the area. And here's your five day forecast. There's a chance of rain tomorrow and cooler temps this weekend. I'm Reagan there with your weather. Back to you. Thanks Reagan. Now it's time to find out what's going on in sports. Hello, FMS Sports fans. I'm Allie, and this is Michaela, and here's a look today's sports. In football news, the guys on the high school varsity team will hit the field tonight for their next challenge of the season. They'll face an upbeat Lubbock High team that is looking to improve their record this in this district matchup. We need everybody possible to show up at the game tonight and help us cheer for our team. The game will be played at People's Bank Stadium here in Wolferson. It will start at 7.30. Go Tigers! Let's find out who are this week's Athletes of the Week. Roll it! Hi, I'm Allie here with Callista. What sport do you play? Volleyball. How long have you been playing? Uh, one year. Um, what do you like most about your sport? Um, I like kidding. Thank you. Hi, I'm Allie here with Brooke. What sport do you play? Volleyball. How long have you been playing? Um, three years. What do you like most about your sport? Um, I like playing with all my friends and just having fun. Thank you. Lucas Flores. Um, what sport do you play? Football. What do you like most about your sport? Hating people. How long have you been playing? Since about seventh, sixth grade. Thank you. Hi, I'm Michaela here with Cherokee. What sport do you play? Football. How long have you been playing? This year. What do you like most about your sport? Uh, I like my teammates. They're awesome. <laughs> Go 
Congratulations, athletes. Starting in tennis news, the next tennis match of our tennis team will be played on Monday. Hi, I'm Jake here with... Jessica. Ashley. What are you working on in tennis? Serves. Our serves and getting our hits over the net. Why do you like playing tennis? Hanging out with friends. It's very competitive. What's coming up next in tennis? We have a match, our last match, Monday. And then we have a, our next tournament in spring. Thank you. The match will be played at the high school and should start at 3.30. That's a look at today's sports. Back to you! That's all we had today. Have a great afternoon. We'll see you later. Bye.